Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Siriana Tarot. This is going to be an energy check-in love reading for my dearest Libras. Libra, we're going to take a look at the person most on your mind or your current situation. And if these messages resonate with you, I am going to ask that you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's see what clear messages, advice, and guidance come through for my dearest Libras for their highest and greatest good. Clear messages, advice, and guidance for my Libras, please. Seven of Swords, all right. Five of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, Seven of Wands, and the World in Reverse. All right, Libra, I definitely feel like you've got someone here that wants to heal things with you. They want to fight for this connection. They're definitely seeing the Ten of Cups with you, which could be entering into a higher level of commitment, marriage, creating a family, um, just making something really solid, secure, and stable out of this. Um, the Seven of Swords energy in reverse tells me your person wants to reveal their true and deep feelings. Um, maybe some of my Libras too, you may have found something out that made you pull your energy back from this person. Um, let's see. All right, so we see the world card in reverse. Yeah, there's unfinished business here. And the high priestess, yeah, secrets are going to be revealed so those are my Libras who feel like this connection is completely over. I'm just going to tell you that your other your person doesn't. The other person doesn't feel that way. They feel like there's unfinished business. And I do feel like they're going to reveal some secrets that are going to make you think twice about fully walking away from this person. So they might just be clearing something up. But it definitely feels like they're going to be coming clean here, Libra. With the Five of Pentacles in reverse, this person's coming out of the cold. They've definitely been holding back or they want to come out of the cold. Yeah, this person is single. They feel foolish about something. Yeah, they feel foolish about something, Libra. This person, um, maybe they've lost a bit of money. Um, some of you, they've been working hard to sort of build up their finances. For others of you, they may have experienced like the loss of a like a loved one. Um, but I do feel like, you know, if this is somebody you have previous dealings with, which it certainly feels like it, they're, they feel foolish for whatever happened here, something they didn't tell you or something they didn't explain or tell you how they were really feeling or what was really going on with them. And with the nine of cups energy in reverse, they know that you're feeling drained. You've definitely walked away from this person or that's their biggest fear. Yeah. The nine of, so they know that you're like really in your head about, hmm, they're, you're really in their, it, Sorry, I cannot speak today. They are they know you are really in your head about something that they feel is a misunderstanding. Um, they know that like you heard or you saw or they did or they said something here, Libra, that really spun you out, that made you move away from this person. In the magician card, they see you not taking action, not communicating with them, and it's driving them nuts. They're gonna come clean. They want to fight for this. This is what we're not seeing in the seven of wands energy. And we have the Nine of Pentacles in reverse and the Two of Cups. This person's willing to do what it takes. I think your person is taking a look at anything that's been unhealthy or they're they're seeing very clearly what they need to do to fix things with you. And they definitely don't want to miss this opportunity with you. With the World card in reverse, Libra, there's unfinished business here for sure. And we get the Ace of Wands in reverse, Rejection, and the Three of Wands. There's a big decision here. Libra, you're going to have to let me know down below in the comment section what happened. Because for some of you, there's been like some sort of tower moment. There's been some sort of shock. Nine of cups energy in reverse. You're walking away. Maybe this person told you they weren't like they never wanted to get married or they, were, they weren't looking for anything solid and secure. Um, very interesting because I feel like double nine of cups energy in reverse. It's been really emotionally draining. But I feel like you two mirror each other in that sense. Like this person... They just, they feel extremely foolish and they want to come out of the cold. They want to make it up to you. They want to clear something up with you. All right, let's see what else we need to know about this person for my Libras. What else do my Libras need to know here? Okay, so we get passionate. We get two cards and they feel you're a perfect match. Yeah, two of cups. And they're coming in with honesty. They're coming in with honesty, Libra. And I think that's where you're going to, you're going to know you know, is this something I should work on? Is this something I'm going to, is this someone I'm going to give a chance or am I going to let them go? 
Yeah, they're probably going to give you a gift. I do see, I like this person's energy, the way they're coming back, because they, they need to clear something up. We are in Mercury retrograde. Remember that it is a, a transit where we're more prone to misunderstandings, misinterpretations. So just bear that in mind. Um, it looks like there's something along those lines that's happened here, or they realize where they messed up and they're coming in to make it up to you. All right, let's see anything else. Let's see what else we need to know here. Anything else my Libras need to know about this connection? You are like no other. Yeah, you're very unique. They love that about you. Planning your future and relationship blossoming. Yeah, some of you, this may have been someone that you were just like kind of, you know, getting to know or dating briefly and the relationship was blossoming and they may have said something that made you be like, ew, okay, no, I definitely am looking for something solid or secure. I am looking for something, you know, more serious. Um, and But they're coming in to get to the heart of the matter and I feel like that's where you're going to really know here, Libra, what you want to do. Um, yeah, what you want to do here. Let's see. Clear messages. Again, let me know in the comment section how this resonates with you because I do see that like there's something here about planning the future, building something solid and secure that made you really question whether or not you can do that with this person. Um, yeah, so detach with love to clearly see the truth. So some of you, this is what you're doing. I also feel that you pulling back Libra has really helped them see like, okay, what's up, what they need to shift or change. Spirit's telling you this, this relationship deserves a second chance and an, an addiction is affecting this relationship, which is interesting because, <clears throat> because this came out in the Aries reading. Um, so if you're dealing with an Aries or you have Aries placements or you're just drawn to that reading, do check that out. But there's something, there's something unhealthy. It doesn't have to be drugs or alcohol, right? Addiction can be anything we need to get out from under. There is something unhealthy that needs to be fixed, that needs to be released. And, you know, and I feel like it could be this person is low-key obsessed with trying to win you back because they see you as their soulmate. Um, yeah, and we see this energy of strictly sexual. But for some of my Libras, maybe that's that's what you're seeing. Maybe you're like, yeah, I don't know if we can, you know, build a future here because of something they did, they said, or something you found out about them. But the ball is definitely going to be in your court here, Libra. So spirit saying, you know, for some of you, you may be deciding to give this person a second chance. For others of you, you may be, you may be moving on. So let me know what your, what your plans are, what, how you're feeling, how this might resonate with you down below. I love reading your comments. Um, and go ahead and check out the description box for ways you can get a private reading or if you like the cards I'm using or if you want to follow me on TikTok and Instagram. Love and light, my dear Libras. Take care.